Hey guys, welcome back to another exciting episode of Texas Model Home Tours. I'm your host, Alex Piak, Evolve Real Estate Group here at eXp Realty. Guys, today we're in Painted Tree Community, uh, one of the most anticipated new communities here in McKinney, Texas. There'll be over 3,500 homes, anything from townhomes to some amazing upscale custom style homes, something to suit everybody. Today, guys, we're at David Weekly Homes. This is their rolling model on their 50-foot lot series. The home we're previewing today is a little over 3,000 square feet. It's four beds, four and a half bath, three-car garage, covered patio, uh, retreat room on the second story, everything that you're probably looking for. Cannot wait to show you this. Uh, it's one of the first times we've actually showcased the David Weekly, so super excited to bring you guys another build on the channel as well. Now make sure you guys hang with us till the end. I'll share with you what's happening with inventory pricing, uh, discounts and incentives that we have available, as well as something brand new, guys. We put together your ultimate relocation guide coming to Dallas, Texas, Discover Dallas. Uh, if you guys wanna get access to that relocation guide, it's got everything you want and need to know about relocating to Dallas. Below the video is the link, download it, enjoy it. It's our gift to you guys. Make sure you hang with us until the end. We'll talk a little bit more about David Weekly, availability, pricing. Um, so make sure you hang with us to the end. Without further ado, let's get started on today's tour. Come on in. Hey guys, welcome inside the Roland model here inside Painted Tree, David Weekly. Uh, we're gonna start off here in the front of the house at the entrance of the house, front door. You'll notice that you have right off the front your guest bedroom, really nice size guest bedroom with your double French door there opening up to your closet. I like how they carried the hardwood floors all the way through to the guest bedroom. Now that is something that will be an upgraded option. Check out some of the attention to detail here. I love what they're doing with all these wooden accents and trims. I like the pendant lights over the two end tables. Nice touch there. Let's move on back to the front of the house. Off the guest bedroom is a full bath with a full stand-up shower. Beautiful tile. Kind of got that herringbone design. We've got the dark countertops with the brush gold door pulls and fixtures. Over here, that is where your garages will be currently being used as the sales room. So that wall will be closed off, obviously. As we move in, take a look at the home office. It's open, no closed off door or anything here. I'm sure you have some options if you were to build. I like the openness. I love these two gigantic windows. Let me give you a little spin around here. They carry that ceramic tile wall. I like the built-ins. Look at that built-in all the way across the top, really framing the work area here in the custom desk with the granite countertops. And then there, they've got that wood trim as well with the ceramic tile wall all through the entrance. We've got a powder bath here for guests. Take a look at that backsplash. I love the accents. And then one of my favorites is when they do the floating cabinets with the under lighting there. Just a great, great little touch. We've got our coat closet, mudroom area with built-ins. 
And then our utility room, washer dryer. I love the custom built-in they've done here. Little folding and laundry area. Put a nice piece of granite slab up there. These are all built ups, nice and tall. Now let's get into the room where people tend to spend the most amount of time, the kitchen. And they have done an excellent job in this kitchen. It's large. I love the waterfall edge on the island. Look at that nice piece, solid waterfall edge. Again, with the under cabinet lighting, you can kind of see the glow as we walk through. We've got two tones on the cabinet, that black island with the kind of light gray, maybe even a pewter tone on the regular cabinets here. Beautiful built-ins, nice oversized six burner gas stove. What do you guys think about those floating shelves? There's a nice little accent over the windows. Having windows in the kitchen, I think is game changer, brings in a lot of natural light. Also, we're so accustomed guys to having sinks in almost every single island. Look at all the cabinets that you now have access to. Because we've got these beautiful large windows, you actually have sink overlooking the outside. That's not something that we see a whole lot of in the models that we've toured. And we've probably toured at this point well over 40 or 50. So David Weekly definitely brings something different, unique. Take a look at that beautiful staircase coming down as we open up to formal dining and living room, which immediately goes to these beautiful cathedral ceilings with that shiplap wood insert, another dark accent wall with the wood trim. Look at the size of those windows. Absolutely just floods the area with natural light. Here's our formal dining space. Beautiful chandelier, oversized sliding glass door. Can't wait to see the comments on this. Let me know guys, what, what are you thinking so far? Here's our beautiful covered patio. As you know, that is essential to have here in Texas. It's a nice breezy, 100 degrees out today as we're out here filming some new model homes. So having that covered space, that shaded space, because we do always have this beautiful breeze. So if you can get out of the direct sunlight and just enjoy that breeze, it is awesome. Here's another view of that huge kitchen. There's our staircase. We'll head upstairs in a second. But I love how they did the wood treads there, horizontal railings. But let's take a look at that primary bedroom. Take a look at that stacked stone accent wall. Take a nice close up for you guys. That is that stacked stone look that you see on fireplaces. We've got huge cathedral ceiling, exposed beam that matches same color as the hardwood floors. And they went really dark on the color in here, but because of these massive windows, take a look at the accent windows. Again, one on each side of the bed. This room is nice and bright, even with that dark charcoal walls and um, yeah, this is a beautiful, beautiful primary suite. Take a look at the bath. Again, we've got that floating cabinet. Let's get down nice and low. You can see that tile goes all the way underneath. Got that nice dark colored stone, the brushed 
gold fixtures. David Weekly Homes, another amazing high quality home. Really excited that we got to bring this to you guys. Take a look at this shower. I love that little mini brick. Built-in soap box, nice attention to detail there. Got our water closet. I think that's the nice formal way to say the toilet. And then here is your walk-in closet on both sides with the openness to the bathroom. So no door there, nice open feel. I like that little window in the middle, bring some natural light in here. And then take a look at this view coming into your primary suite. Beautiful cathedral ceilings. Love that chandelier with that black undercarriage with that brushed gold upper. Whew, spectacular. And again, this is gonna be their classic series on their 50 foot lots. Here's another view of that shiplap ceiling. All right, let's head on upstairs and take a look at what great surprises they might have for us up there. Take a look at those three light fixtures. Very cool design. Okay, here we are upstairs. You can see we've got the open railing to the front of the house and back of the house. We've got the little bonus loft room here. Take a look at this bath. Cool design. What do you guys think about these floors? Would you guys have the guts to pick that color if you were building your own home? Nice bedroom upstairs. And our second bedroom upstairs. That's a cool, funky light there. Another good size room. Lots of natural light pouring in again from the front of the house with those three windows. And this bathroom does have its full ensuite. We've got our tub with our full floor to ceiling or tub base to ceiling ceramic tile. Very cool floor design that they picked out. Little roller skate action there. Good sized room, I like it. Definitely different, unique, not a ton of just like non-functional space. All the square footage here, and again, it's about 3,018 square feet. All very functional, all very usable. Let's head on downstairs.
take a look at that ceiling again as we come down. Very pretty. All right, let's head outside. Let's talk a little bit more about David Weekly. Hey guys, that's gonna conclude today's model home tour. Thank you very much to David Weekly Homes, uh, the Roland model, awesome, awesome property. I can't wait to see what you guys have to say. So make sure you guys share your comments, your thoughts, let us know what you liked and you didn't like. If this is your first time to the channel, make sure you like today's video. Make sure you subscribe, plus click the little bell. That'll give you notifications every time we drop brand new model home tours just like this. Now, as I promised for hanging to the end, number one, make sure you download the relocation guide if you're thinking about moving to Dallas. Number two, most importantly, if you're thinking about buying a brand new construction home anywhere here in DFW, we'd love to be your new construction resource, all things new construction here in Dallas. Uh, below is my contact information along with a link to our Zoom calendar where you can schedule a virtual in-person where we can share with you everything that's happening in new construction here in DFW. So make sure you schedule. We'd love to chat, tell you what's happening with pricing, inventory, availability, the new builders, the new communities. Uh, answer all your questions. Make sure you guys find the perfect home, perfect builder, and get you the best deal we possibly can. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you on the next model home tour. Take care.